Hi guys, um, it is Sunday, um, so yeah, we haven't picked up the camera this weekend because we have been babysitting our niece um, and my sister's dogs. Just with it being her birthday, um, my parents got her a trip away to a lodge for the weekend, so we were on aunt and uncle duty. Um, so yeah, we have gotten home today um, and yeah, uh, Liam's mum and dad very kindly uh, watched Zola for us at our house um, and yeah it was, it was lovely it was very nice of them um, but yeah so today I mean to be honest I don't know if Liam will pick you up again today um, I just wanted to quickly jump on uh, just to show something but um, before that yeah we've basically just been chilling all day if I'm honest um, I've got a little clip which I'll get Liam to put in now of Zola having a little snooze on the sofa with us um, it's the first time in a while that she's done that um, so yeah she was knackered so it was really nice to have her have a little snooze and we ended up having a cheeky little snooze with her as well because we were just knackered after after watching uh, Paige all weekend but yeah I just wanted to quickly show you guys um we mentioned a week or maybe two ago about getting Zola a new car seat because we felt that the other one wasn't very safe um but basically we were struggling to get it built because it's got loads of little um tube like plastic tubes in it to build the frame um but they weren't connecting like the connectors mustn't I don't know they must have just been really tight or something because uh Thankfully, uh, Liam's dad has very kindly built it for us while we were away. We'd had it half done, but we just couldn't get the last few bits done at the top. So yeah, I just thought I would quickly show you it built. So this is the new car seat. Um, so yeah, I know I was trying to show you on the clip last weekend, it might have been now, how it was supposed to look based on the instructions, but it was quite difficult to show you. But yeah, this is the car seat. So that's the top of it that goes sort of around the back of the car, um, the car seat, um, and they go into the back of it as well, just as a stabiliser, I think. But yeah, so that is what the car seat looks like. I am obsessed with it. I think it is so much better than what we did have. Um, and we do also, underneath the old one, have a little blanket that we bought for her, just to put a blanket in there as well, just so that, because it is a lot bigger than, well, it's not necessarily bigger, but I think it's just more open space than the um, than what the bed version was. So it's just a little something for her, just so it's a little bit softer, feels a bit more cosy. Um, but yeah, I just, I'm over the moon with that. I feel like she's going to be so much safer in there. Um, there's still the buckle here to to attach a harness to it. So she is still going to be attached in. But yeah, so I am absolutely chuffed with that. Um, and that was on Amazon for any, um, any fellow for parents that are looking for something for their dog to transport them in. Amazon had a lot of great, um, great options really. But yeah, so... That was it really. I just wanted to quickly jump on and show you guys that. Like I say, I don't know if we're going to pick the camera up again tonight just because, as I say, we have had a full on weekend. Um, we've just sort of come back and we've been quite chilled. You've just seen there as well. I have done a little yoga session, which is the first one since my wrist flare up. Um, so yeah, I, that felt great to, to just get back into it and to do something and just to move my body really. Um, but yeah, so that's the most exercise that I've done in nearly two months because my, uh, I was I was unwell and then when I felt ready to to do exercise again my wrists flared up and they've been on and off for about three weeks now um and they're finally better so I thought you know what I'm just gonna do a quick session um and yeah now back to chilling probably a nice bath later that's what actually where Liam is at the moment he's having a nice soak in the bath um, and Zola is having a nap. So yeah, once he's out of the bath, I'll probably get myself in. Um, and then I think we do have a few things to do this week that we will show you. One of which is finishing this little area there. So I'll leave you guys with that one. And one last admiration of the panel wall that we did last weekend. Hi guys, it is Wednesday today. Um, it is after five, I've not long finished work. Liam is feeling a little bit under the weather. He's got, by the sounds of it, a little bit of acid reflux. So he's uh, took some Gaviscon and he is in bed. Um, I'm just gonna have to go to B&M. <sighs> Gutted. 
Um, but yeah, midweek B&M trip because Zola has actually decided today when I've been working from home and I've had her in a crate for a little bit to bite out the stuffing in her bed, in her crate. So we now need to go and get her a new bed. So I need to go and get that. Um, and we do need a couple of other bits. So I just thought I would bring you guys along with me. Well, that was a bit of a fail. Um, got everything else that I needed, all of the little bits, but no bed for Zola. They didn't have the right style or size for her crate. So I'm gonna have to try pet at home and pray that they've got the right size in. Do you approve? Do you like your new bed? <laughs> Do you like your new bed? Hi guys back home now with Zola um, and as you can see I did manage to pick up a bed um, which she's trying to pull off the uh, get off the key please oh <laughs> okay uh, nope off that there you go uh, yeah we found a bed in pets at home oh god's sake this is a good plan hold on Okay, I've took that off now, so she's now just pulling at the bed itself. But yeah, I did manage to find one in Pets at Home, um, which was in, um, thankfully, I, I couldn't find any that were the right sort of shape. Um, and then the, the lovely woman at Pets at Home did direct me to the puppy section, and these were specifically made... There's a few sizes of these, but they were specifically made for the, the crates that Pets at Home sell. So yeah, it should fit, but yeah. Zola's new bed acquired. Thank God for that. <sighs> After all of that, we might have a small issue. Princess Zola doesn't seem to like how much it's like, how poofy it is. Let's see if she'll do it. She'll probably warn because she wouldn't do it without a treat. Zola, in your crate. In, in, come here. Zola. Zola. Oi. In your crate. In your crate. Look. In, in. No, no, she wasn't doing it before with a, without a treat. But yeah, she was in, and then she was kind of just stumbling about. Didn't really seem too comfy. So don't really know what to do for bed tonight, or like whether we keep that in there, or whether we just put her in with all of our black. Off that, please. Whether we put her on with all of our blankets, I don't really have anywhere else to try to try and find another one tonight. But, ugh. yeah, bloody dog. Why did you have to bite a bloody bed? Right, everybody, happy Friday. It is the weekend. Um, Zola has just been outside there. Have you just had a wee wee? I think you have, by the way. You're sitting waiting for something. Um, so we'll give her a quick little treat. But... Mm. It is five to six, and me and Katie are about to pop to Ikea. Um, and we're going to go to Nando's because we've still got vouchers. Every time we've been meaning to go to Nando's, one of us has always been, like, unwell. Here you are, Dom. I'll just chuck it over to you. Good girl. Um, but, yeah, we're going to go to Ikea to get some paneling? No. Jesus Christ, my mind has gone blank. But oh, some shelving units to go probably like this corner here. I don't know if Katie wants one up the top. I'm really not sure what we're actually getting, like where we're going to put the shelving unit. But just something to sort of finish off in here. Um, and then obviously, we'll show you us getting in this vlog. And then we'll probably this weekend film the sort of final reveal of this wall. And also... Put the pricing up i might actually that might be a bonus vlog to put up beforehand um and all that good stuff because it actually might not be too much of a long one it might literally just be us sort of sitting down like we did in the last one and pointing out how much everything was um because this one is a little bit more expensive on the panel inside of everything and then we don't know how much we're going to spend sort of decorating well not decorating but getting the last little bits to show off i will also quickly put something on the screen now editing this back later remember my mum tagged us in something 
and it's basically this lighting that goes along the top of the paneling and it does look really nice now we are thinking about possibly getting that um, and looking into that because i do think that makes it it already looks like really expensive but i feel like that yeah but like i think that lighting will just take it to that next level where like mm. if it when it's like dark in here you could literally have like just that on if you sat at the table and it'll just look i don't know it'll just look really nice but yeah that'll have been on the screen already and i'm a big fan of it but it, i've got a feeling that's gonna be that's, really expensive yeah, did you I look was, i didn't look at the price but no. that's what i thought as well because yeah. it does look really well done and I'll yeah how oof. how expensive is it going to be but yeah. we'll look into it um and if you guys are watching and it, it's something that you want to do because i've got a weird feeling also that we're going to have had to have left a bit of a gap at the top possibly yeah that's I the mean, only that's right if yeah it's if no, it's no gap yeah. i don't know so we will have to look into have it i will do something like that this vlog just to sort of let you guys know as well because we had a few comments of people saying that they absolutely like, they did love this they, were, they had some ideas from it that they were going to do it and stuff like that and i couldn't recommend it higher enough to be like highly enough to be fair even if you wanted something where you had two panels dead center i think that would look really nice and you painted both sides of the wall like a mm -hmm. a nice yeah, color yeah. like a color like this or like a green like that we've got in there or whatever color you wanted really you could sort of do something like that you could just go for the one like a lot of people do um but yeah i would definitely recommend it we are going a bit panel mad at the minute we have discussed another project uh for paneling but i'll not give that away yet but yeah i'm gonna stop waffling we're gonna get in the car and we're gonna head to ikea <laughs> So we didn't pick these up last night when we got back because we had to say Zola and to be honest we were just absolutely knackered and yeah as you can see everything was just dumped on the table and left for today so we're going to go through what we picked up now some of the stuff we'll be able to put straight up some of the stuff we're going to put up a bit later on or tomorrow we'll uh, sort of show you that if needs be Kate just picking her little treats out <laughs> um, yeah she's got some caramel freddos but yeah, I think I'll start with this black bag first because this was a very, yeah, this was a very sort of, like impromptu. yeah, we didn't, this was just from a little stall in the Metro, yeah, uh, like, like an arts, cra arts and crafts like stall it. thing on, didn't there, where there was all sorts, mm -hmm. um, and Katie oh. got this for what is currently the games room, but is changing, I'll leave that up to you to guess what we're changing that into, but something exciting so ta -da. it is of the sycamore gap and it was like at a milky way or something when that was happening um so yeah that was really nice and you loved it didn't you Kate? Yeah, nice. so we picked nice. that up yeah and sycamore gap. we never yeah. actually we never actually got to see it, see it and now local. yeah some of you chopped it down i also brought katie some earrings from there it's from like a different store but yeah but they're quite nice she liked them she doesn't buy earrings quite a lot and they weren't like majorly expensive either yeah. so and I don't <coughs> it's, it's more like i've got quite a lot of hoops yeah there, but i don't have many studs, studs that are nice like the studs 
not that the studs I've got are nice, but like nice and small. I mean, yeah. like quite dainty ones. The studs I've got are a bit bigger. Bigger. Um, so yeah, like, and I want to get my seconds done. Yeah. So with, with the current studs, it kind of would take up a lot of the space of my ear. Yeah. So with these, at least they're nice and dainty Dude. and they can fit in the gap and then I can get a second. So then on to <clears throat> the main stuff. Sorry if I keep clearing me throat. My chest is really, really bad. So we got... This shelf here, the LAC, that was one of the first things we picked up from Ikea. That is going to go up there. Oh, the colour's actually really nice as well, isn't it? Mm -hmm. um, it's going to go about there. Pretty so. much about bang on there. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to get that. We also got these two. <coughs> oh, yeah, we picked up two shelves for the bathroom. I will just show you what they're called. They're called the Persby. Um, so we'll put them down, but they're going to go up in the bathroom. We are also getting our bath resealed tomorrow um, because it's got a lot of cracks in now. And if you're a long time viewer, um, it didn't get silicon right the first time, which led to a couple of leaks, didn't it? Yeah, it was, the silicon wasn't done right when we <clears> moved <throat> in um, near the shower. So yeah. we were having a shower and the wall was just going behind. It bath. leaked under the carpet, um, didn't it? It was the carpet, yeah, and the skirt and board and everything was a bit... Yeah. And then, yeah, not nothing really special, just a toilet brush, because the ones we picked up from Amazon, the top, the one upstairs broke, so... Yeah, and then we picked up... Yeah, that was cool. here, isn't it? Yeah, we're getting rid of that, and we're going to get that, and then that's what all these flowers that we picked up were for. Oh! oh. Fake oh. flowers. Yeah, <laughs> Anyways, they're not like obviously real, but yeah, they're gonna go on the table. Look really nice in the so the summer. Like, and then Yeah. We'll show you all when it's all sorted out as well. But then Katie also picked up this plant. That's gonna sit on that shelf that goes up there. Hopefully that's mm -hmm. a nice fit. Yeah, but and then we picked up some more they're just for Zola's um food to the frost in, so nothing exciting, but yeah. Overall, I think I put the price on the screen. I think it was just under £100 or something like that. Um, for the stuff from Ikea. The print with the frame was like 42 was it? Mm -hmm. um, yeah. But yeah, really, really like that, to be fair. So, yeah, apart from that, I'm going to rest my chest. And we will pick his back up when we are putting the shelves up, whether that be today or tomorrow. everybody sorry about how this vlog has ended i think as you can tell and as i'm watching this vlog back i was severely unwell well not severely unwell that's a bit dramatic but i was unwell last um not last sunday the was it last sunday sunday before but basically i spent the whole following week pr like off work i went in on the monday got sent home and then didn't really recover until like friday morning I would say after I'd went back to sleep I just had really bad chest pains and I was just like loaded with flu basically but yeah and then like it was funny because someone I seen someone online I think mentioned COVID again like oh I've got COVID and I was like oh my god like imagine if I had that again four years on but it is just a flu like that's all I had it was just yeah I just caught it really bad but yeah we didn't show the final result of the downstairs because we're going to show that in the next vlog where we go over the pricing and stuff and then the week after I'm actually off work so there will be daily vlogs again the like sort of bank holiday week so that I'm looking forward to that and I hope you guys are too so yeah remember to subscribe and to the channel if you're not already like the video if you did enjoy and also big thanks to Katie for carrying a bulk of this vlog i think because i was so on and off unwell she had to carry this one so yeah if you did enjoy that remember to hit the thumbs up get a comment and if you did and i will catch you in the next one